Well, semi recently. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. We're doing this cube. Afternoon, Frank and Mooch. I'll just want to say I took the final necklace for a run through 25, 25 matches last night. Figured that'd be a decent amount of playing. I went 19 6. I used Stone Cold Serpent and Walking Ballista since I didn't have any. So thank you. Dude, Walking Stone Cold Serpent is a great, um, a great change. 19-6 is insane, dude. That's a pretty good record. That's a great record, my dude. Zimini Pod, congrats, man. I'm super glad I could help. Wow, that's, that's like, exciting. It's like slightly better than 3-1. to one. Yeah, that's really exciting. It's a good record. Wow. That's a high win percentage, my dude. What's our pick here? Uh, I would either take Vista mm. or Eureka. Wow, you would take terrible cards. What's wrong with Vista? Oh, okay, actually, first off, wait, I wanted to take this yesterday, like, and you're like, "No, take this." That was only because that was only because of the certain pick. I still <laughs> think it's a great card. What I think you actually should take. Oh my god, maybe take Zell's conscripts. I was thinking Zell's conscripts. Okay, good. I feel better. Preordain's also very, very good. Badger, 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 Badger. Oh, Badger, Badger. with the twenty gifted subs. If you guys get a gifted sub, you should definitely do me a favor. And resubscribe afterwards, because that would be super cool. But, Badger, you are awesome, my dude. Now we just take Goblin. Badger, guys. Badger, 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 Badger. I love Thank you, my you. dude. You are friggin' awesome. He has 30 subs to go to get to the 500 gifted subs. Oh my god. That's insane. Now you Thank take Goblin? You. No, fucking shut up. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you want to win, you take the Goblin Guide. If you want to have oh fun, you take the god. Tropical Island or the... Oh, uh, Wall gracious. Roots. Wall of Roots is good, too. Thank you. What's a pick, man? Tropical Island? Thank I like Tropical Island. Oh, hold on. This is the San Antonio call. I'm going to say Trop, and then I'm going to answer this. Thank you. Hello? Oh, hello, sir. Yes. Oh, sorry. I didn't even hear it right now. No, you're good. Okay, that time I actually did mute it because I wanted to make sure there wasn't any like sensitive information. You like ancient you want to tomb? Turn up the volume again. Oh well, we can turn it up, but like, all right, what's going on? Welcome. Oh, the the, welc the thank yous are still going. Oh shoot, what is it? You like ancient tomb here? Yeah. Oh god. Friggin' catacombs is nice. Drop them on. Yeah. Simic signets also nice. I think fe do you, fetches or or signets is really like a I big think question. Signets are more powerful. Thank like the you. Man, all right. Priest, you think containment priest? So I guess we're going rug. Hmm. Now what are we going? Bluesels and greensels. Now what are we going? Just red. Okay, so it doesn't. Yeah, we're good. I'm gonna take Verdant Catacomb. Really? Right. You want? This keeps us open to any other shock land. That's true. I like how you put that one tundra. land on the sideboard, but, I, the, other but the other two aren't. <laughs> you can get a tundra. Oh, marsh flats too. Marsh Flash does not get us lands, though, currently. Well, Tundra doesn't get searched for, either. Right. We could so be both. a sweet Banty Boy deck. Also, Man, this We could have had Goblin Guide and Hellrider. I'm going to take this. Oh, Questing oh, I Beast? You're, I think you're doing the Nick Esposito one, where you just take all the lands and then take I'll all take the dual lands and fetch lands super, super high, because they're just so good. Questing Beast, huh? I didn't see the rest of the pack. It was only green card. Do that thing where you say <clears throat> you hang up, but then you don't, and then you say, let's both hang up at the same time, but then you don't again. It's... <laughs> What, to the customer service rep? Yeah, we should do that. Hey. No, you hang up first. Okay, you give me that tracking number for my cell phone. Thank you. You know, I can tell you most customer service can't hang up, so that game's all, they're always going to win that game. Really? Yeah. Most so if I just stay on the phone? Yeah. I'll be like, all right, man, I'll see you later. I think there's like some kind of like, eventually at some point they can be like, okay, it's been X amount of time. I can, if we don't have anything else, I have to let you go, sir, or whatever. But Time's wasted. It's at my job, like you're not supposed to hang up with people. 
Unless they say they can and do hang. Out. Unless they say goodbye. Goodbye. I don't know why. I'm just I, gonna hang people I wish all I could day, take this all day, every day. I'm just but... hanging up on people. That's that sounds like you. I like Trigon Predator here. There's a lot of things this guy can hit. We don't really have a direction yet. There's nothing. We haven't opened anything. I'd like to take this, but we're, our mana base is not suited for this. Also, Hero Blade holds good, but I'd rather just stay green. We're clearly green and blue. That's all we really I know. agree with that. Go Haste Tribal. Actually, with Questing Beast and Zealous Conscripts, it's not too shabby. Haste Tribal. Yeah, we should. maybe the Goblin got a wheel. I used to hang up on people all the time, work for phone company, but I was awesome. They wouldn't fire me the like. All right. You know you're not supposed to hang up on people, but you can stay. Well, at our, at our job, like, we're not technically supposed to hang up on people, but, like, we kind of can once they're like, I'm like, have a good day, and they're like, thank you, and then they don't say anything, you can kind of do it then. <clears throat> Gideon Blackblade is pretty cool. So is Resto. So is Glorybringer. So very late him. Lumbering Falls black. is good, too. Yeah, I don't I know if I want, I don't know if want a double white card here. I'll just take the Falls. I would. I like a Falls. I think we don't really pick where we're going until we get something super strong. Right, nothing in here is like super compelling me. Gideon Blorp Blade. Yes. Double fight card? What is that? What are you saying right now? What's a double fight card? What is this? A crash has been a crash report has been generated. Okay, don't cool. I don't that's great. Eureka tabled, take it. Eureka tabled. This is terrible. Why do you want to take this? Just take the Dragon Lord of Tarkin. Yeah, I was thinking that too. I'm like, we could just splash it. We're not splashing. You said double white, so I said double white. Oh, but that doesn't even exist. You you named a fake card. I can't imagine working for any sort of call center and not going completely insane. That's I don't understand how Mike does it. Because it's not customer service, so it's a lot different. I don't have to be nice to people. Oh wow! Like someone called me rude, and I was like, whatever. <sighs> That's care. late. That's real late. Yeah. I love Angel of Sanctions. I also like Vivian Reed. I think Vivian Reed's better though. Maybe. Not too late to go Haste Tribal with Goblin Guide. <laughs> I, I wonder how many of those Haste creatures are coming back, too. Eureka is never good, oh. never. Yeah, it can be hard Ooh, to be Dragon good. Dragon Boy and a Path to Exile. I do like Path here. Yeah, but we're not white. We have a Tundra. We have one Tundra. We have a Tundra, Michael. Plus, think about what Katie would say if you didn't take it. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> That's a compelling argument. Oh, Containment <coughs> Priest came back. I wonder if this is... That's gotta be Although I think though. it was the wrong pick. I think Path was actually... The wow, pick, you son of a bitch. Are we just Naya? No, there's no way we're Naya. Although well, this could be. Wow, alright. Got a bunch of good white cards here. Oh, Frost Titan, power! <laughs> I mean, it is a powerful card. I think we take like Bloodbraid Elf. I think that'd be sick. I'm pretty sure Tefri's real sick. Eureka's cast. I like also like Tefri because we can get it back with Sun Titan, which is pretty gas. Oh yeah, it's that one. Also, it shuts down lots of things: cryptic commands, Mystic Confluence, Mana Mana Tide, Mana Drain. Like yeah, if you want to commit to playing white, I do because I have Sun Tights. Sun. It was a polluted Delta. It's pretty good. It is good. It can get or Tundra can take Taiga, and Tropical. I yeah, think this is more important. Lands, yeah. Hopefully the Tiger wheels. I think it might. I mean, if any land wheels, it's Tiger's definitely land, got yeah. a high chance. Nobody cares about red green. Eureka's Castle. You guys know Eureka's Castle? That was like an old Nickelodeon show. You think you're going to get demonetized? I don't know. Probably not. No one gives a shit about this. This is weird. This is the horror version. Oh, this is the horror version. I don't know what that means. Oh, windswept teeth is gas. Uh, it gets trop. It gets forest trop and tundra and plains. It's pretty good. And potentially taiga if it wheels. Yeah, that's that's really good. We're taking that for sure, black my dude. Oh, that's really that's really sad actually. Master of the Wild Hunt is nice. Master uh, Wallet Hunt is, is uh, Master Wallet Hunt. Master Wallet Hunt is a card everyone. <laughs> What'd you call? Him? Master don't worry, Wallet Hunt. Don't. Is that it? Don't worry about it. Uh, it was a verbal slip. It wasn't actually a, a verbal slip. Master Wallet Hunt is a card that that everyone criticizes. Yet it's super, super good. 
I like how Nick basically only types in caps. That's his. <laughs> Unless he was trying to yell at you this time. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. I don't think Finale's very good. <sighs> it's just this guy? It's just Master Wild Hunt, correct? Sure. Nice to meet you. My name is Mike Hunt. Also, Tide Taker. Nah, man. Who clipped that? Wow. <laughs> Awkward. Also, if anyone likes to, would like to know, the uh, egg rolls at 7-Eleven, pretty bad. Not an edible, but very bad. Won't somebody please think of the children? What about egg rolls? What did you say? The egg rolls at 7-Eleven. Is that code for something? Wow. Oh, I like a Lanowar Elf here. Uh, I think we should take Grizzlebrand. You're, you're kidding, right? No. Not you're, not, you're not kidding? No, take it. You can get it back with Sun Titan. No, but it's, it's Lanowar Elf. We can or get Racto it back. With, what does Racto Signet do? Shut up. It's got one of our colors. So you want to take one ramp card that has no real colors in our deck except for these over... Oh, Savannah. That is a late Mind Twist. Nobody respects Mind Twist. No There's color. a late him to Torok, too. Can you imagine if we went black, we'd get Gristlebrand, him to Torok, and Mind Twist? Should have been black. I mean, the lands that we're getting are great. Do we need a Savannah over a Colonnade, though? Colonnade is just... Colonnade is just very strong. I'll take a Colonnade. Maybe Savannah might even come back because it's just uh, like... There's been a murder there. There's a murder in Savannah. I'm trying to find this Eureka's Castle theme song. Here it is. Oh, look. Oh, 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 yo, you me, you me, you see who? Eureka. Oh, me? No, you. Don't you see? That's 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 the thing that yeah, gets stuck in my head. Can we the and the watery grave? Warm coil or a Leshnorn? Ooh, that's. I think tough. it's warm coil. It's very close. I don't think we're gonna want a double white stuff. So probably warm boy. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna want double white stuff, as we play Sun Titan. I don't think we're playing. Sun Titan. I think Sun Titan is way too good not to play with these. Another dual land we don't want. Oh, sea Chrome Coast is not terrible. Take for the third Reach and Hope, or the third pack. Wow. I think we already passed the number call, do we not? I don't know. Lamb chop was better. Wow, I didn't know it was a contest, but I guess so. You're welcome to think that. I'm just saying it got stuck in my head, that's just all. Just take the coast. You don't have to flex on us about your favorite your favorite children's show. Oh, this Night is of my Autumn. Favorite children's show. That's also a great hit with Sun Titan. You're right. Buddy, I know it. Has Mike read Sun Titan? I don't know, man. He's not very... He doesn't... It's double white, though. Guys, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you something, actually, that we discovered recently. Mike actually doesn't know how to read. I just read that chat. Did you, though? Yes. Mm. Okay, you can read, but only short sentences. It's true. Oh, so good. What is that? Arizona Energy. Arizona energy. How energized do you feel right now? So energized. I'm drinking coffee and an energy thing. God damn. Although the energy things from Arizona aren't really like they're not like an energy. Yeah, drink. you're not like getting you're not getting juiced. juiced yeah. They just got like ginseng. Mike it. has an earpiece in, and that produces a reading the chat to him and feeding him his lines. Typical. We don't use that word found out. for length. <laughs> attenuated. What is that? Well, Wait, I don't even know what attenuated means. What was the word that I? What was the word that we're talking about? Mike really does seem pumped. Both eyes are open. <laughs> well, when I wake up after 2, I seem to do a lot better. Well, when you go to bed after 6 a.m. Hey, man, I went to bed at like 5.55. Short. <laughs> hey, man, don't call me short. I have a... Uh... Length, whatever. Attenuated, Michael. Attenuated. 
What does that mean? Look it up. Google it. No. Fine, I'll do it myself. Oh, I got a tithe taker? All right. I think we're more white than you want to admit. I think we're basically base. We're base. We're definitely base band. We have like two base blue band. cards. We're white. We're white green, splashing blue, and maybe red. Bitter Blossom, Dark Confidant, and Spellseeker come back. I'm gonna take Spellseeker in case we hit uh, an ancestral or time walk in this last pack. Having mm. been reduced in force, effort, or value, then are reduced in thickness. Late mother runes. Late, Man, late. ravages of war, my dude. I feel like no one respects the ravages. Well, no power here, but we have definitely gotten multiple pieces of power. Um, we got one passed to power. us. One piece of power? What are you talking about? Oh, uh, that's not true. We did to get time walk packs to us like twice. Yeah, that's what I mean. It was like it happened multiple times. I think it's just swords here. Sword seems great. However, we do have Trop. We didn't get that. That Savannah or the Taiga did not come back, which is fine. I'm probably just going to cut these for now. Yeah, there's no real reason to play red. I mean, if we can get a Plateau or... or like a Volcanic. Yeah, then we might have a reason. I think it's Swords. I don't think we're going to have... <laughs> yeah, we already have enough kill artifacts. I don't think so. it's Rufellos here. No, it's no way it's Rufellos. Oh, it's definitely Oko, though. Wait, let's make sure there's nothing else. Let's see... Big to fairy, natural order. Natural order is cute. We don't have enough green creatures no. though, by any by any stretch of the imaginations. Yeah, it's definitely I like Oko. Teferi, but Teferi might even come back. I don't think Oko's coming back, but mm, I yeah, doubt Oko's coming back. But Oko's Oko a sick boy. Oko in all formats. What's a good website to buy a headset off of? A good website to buy a headset off of? Yeah. It won't cost me too much. Uh, you Google best headsets of 2019, and then you find it on Amazon. And then you let me know which one you want, and I'll buy it for you, and then I can you can just PayPal me. So that you I wonder if days. I might be able to get it cheaper at the Best Buy through the special friend discount. Maybe. If they have it, yeah, for sure. That actually could work. But I, I, if I remember, I would like still heads, Google. Do, if do I remember, some research, though, figure out what the best headset is. If I do remember, <laughs> headsets.biz, robsmom.co. That is a good place to get it. Here, let's check that and see what they have right now. But what I what I learned over there was it sank because they didn't have nearly enough weight in the center, and it was it literally had been on the water for ten minutes and it sank. So it should have got. They should have got. That's your mom. like fourth pixels. <laughs> But what I what I learned over there was, was it sank the because they didn't have nearly enough weight in the center. Your mom has enough weight in the center. Your mom also has enough weight in the center. Hey man, don't you can't switch the joke. Oh, that is insane. There's, I, that is the best. There were two better. There, the best card. In there were two better cards than Sol Ring in the in the in the pack. There's no way. Oh Eugene. Carl Eugene. Eugene, 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 Eugene. You know that? You know that song? The other two packs had like infinite lands in them, but this one said like no lands in it. That's because the other ones had all the lands. That's a fair point. Oh, we've seen Tundra, Tropical Island, and uh, Savannah, so there's not going to be dual lands. We saw Windswept Teeth. I didn't see Flooded Strand or Misty Rainforest yet. Those are possible. We saw Celestial Colony and Lumbering Falls, so we're not going to see those. We could still see during Wildwood. Like, I'm pretty sure Soaring is considered the most powerful card in Cube. I agree. I think it's close. I think you can argue like Ancestral, but like that's the only other card. I, I think Lotus think. is worse than than Soaring. Definitely, yeah. Is it Ugin or is this? I kind of like Starter. I mean, it depends on your deck. I guess if you're playing like a Yawgwil deck, Lotus is a little better, but even then, it's very close. Thorin is just stupidly busted. Oh, now you know that song. I do, because you told me about it. So, I don't... We can get, like, a turn... 
Nick, you can't introduce people to something and then get mad when they know that thing. That doesn't make any sense. We could have like a turn through Vivian Reed. Or... Oh, Vivian Reed. This pack sucks. There's nothing for us in this pack. This pack is actually really bad. There's actually, no land to fix. Uh, Rebel Arc gets back Knight of Autumn, gets back Trigon Predator, Tithe Taker, Selfless Spirit, Land of World, playable. Mother of Rune. I don't think it's terrible. No, it's all right. It's four through flyer. It's a decent threat. Oh, Razor Ridge Ticket is not great. Uh, Mole Drifter or Banishing Light. Um. Mm. Let's see, we have Swords. We have Swords. We have Swords. Yeah, I think we take the Banishing Light. I think really? we're a little out of removal. Mole Drifter for Survival Arc is nice, but I do think we need removal. <laughs> Jolene slowed down to 33. Wow, this seems terrible. Also, uh... I want to play this and mute the channel after this. Because this sounds ridiculous. I, this has to sound ridiculous. What are you thinking? What? Well, Sun Titan can also get back Banishing Light, so I think it's Banishing Light. I like that too, actually. That is a selling point for me. As much as I like Mole Drifter. Oh, Marari's Wake. Is that a thing we want to do? I don't think so. It's powerful, but like we don't have very many payouts for it. Carnage. Maybe we just take Sword. Really? Or Thalia. So is, this is a good, good sword. I think it's Sword or Thalia. I think we have too many Planeswalkers to be Thaliaing. Like we have Banishing Light, Vivian, Teferi, Oko, Vivian. Okay. We can also get Sword back with, with Sun Titan again. True. Everything here on down, except for like literally Charter Course and Swords, can we can get back with Sun Titan. It does feel very hard to lose if you ever connect with a Sword of Body of Mine. Or if you ever get to cast a Sun Titan with like a an Oko or a Teferi in the, in the graveyard. I like an every and Oh, I like Gideon here actually. I was gonna say sure. Blightning, but I kinda at Grightling, I'd rather have another four drop that Grightling's okay, but I think Gideon's definitely better. We could also just play Disenchant main deck if we really need to. We could. But I'd probably just play Rex Sage instead. What about Linvala? Linvala seems fine. It's okay. I didn't take Rex Sage because you already have Knight of Autumn and and Disenchant and Banishing Light. Body and Mind is pretty much the only playable sword. Just hope. No, I don't think that's true at all. I think Sword of Fire and Ice is insane. Yeah, I think I think, I think Fire Sword and Ice. of uh, the Black Green one is also Fe Feast good. and Famine. I think those are the three playable ones. Yeah. Oh, Stone Forge. Oh, the Teferi did came back. Oh wow. Yeah. Wow. Uh. I think I like Teferi more. Yeah, we only have one equipment. If we had like Batter Skull, I could see arguing for the Stone Forge. But. Yeah, or if I had like Jitte or something. Stony McBoney. Wow, that Teferi coming back is a, like a treasure. That is a treat. It's a treasure and a treat. Uh, uh. Is that one any good in our deck? I don't know. That's what I was wondering. <sighs> what is her minus? He can't read. See, I told you. He's asking what the minus is, is yeah. while he's reading it, and he can't read. That's. I'm can you get any card with her? Can you get, does it have to be a creature? Can you get any card? It says it right on the card. Exile one face, put the rest on the bottom. If it's a creature, you can cast it. You can get it. says it on the card, but he can't read, so he's having a hard time. Hmm. <laughs> it's small. I know, Michael. It's very small text. That's what, that's what your girlfriend said. That is very small text, yeah. We make two cuts. I don't know what they're gonna be. Linvala. Really? That's not that great. Wow, that's racist. Oh, Razor Verge ticket. Hmm, that ain't bad. Hmm. Now we can splash. Oh, we also got a moat in the sideboard. That's pretty cool. All right, so I think that's fine, Linvala. We can also cut the Vivian. Thirteen creatures. Would you also consider playing 16 lands with a soul ring? I don't like that. Well, it's kind of like a land. Moving an 8 drop and two 6 drops. A bunch of 5 drops. Okay. This deck looks good. I'm a fan. We have soul ring and ancient tomb. We are very light blue. We put like one island in the deck. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 blue cards. We have how much? 1, 2... Delta's three, four, five, six, seven. This is eight sources with one blue. Yeah, okay. Uh, green, we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
nine, ten. I'm gonna say nine for now. It's gotta be ten, right? And then we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'd rather go nine nine because we do have a lot of white. Four. We could argue not playing the island too. We only have four. Oh, we have well, actually we have the five blue cards. Oh, we got a Winsaw Teeth in the board too. Jeez. Good call. Good call. So add those to the. D oh, that's seventeen lands already. Jeez, what the fudge? Okay, so green sources we have one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It seems low to me. One, two, three. Delta can't get anything, right? No. No, Delta gets crop. You're right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. White sources, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, nine. So nine, nine, and then blue. Actually, we might not need the island. Yeah, because we have one sub heath is one, colonnades two, islands three, four, four, five, five, five six, six seven, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I don't think we need nine sources of blue. And also, like the um, I don't know. I was gonna say that. So oh, we don't need lands. we don't have anything with with double blue. So like once we get, it's not like we have to get two sources of blue. Is this still seventeen lands? No, this is sixteen lands. Now we have to add one land. So either one, either two, three, planes four, or forest. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I'll say a forest. I like a forest better anyway because I want to play land of worlds on turn one. So that's a good argument. Yeah. All right. Let's see if this deck does anything. Well, hold on. Before we do that, the only problem I see with this deck is it was a little fair. But hold on. Laurel. Yanni. <laughs> Laurel. What up, Zaychi? Just a few more days when the Mike B meme will die. Which one? Which Mike B meme are you referring to that's going to die? What? There's a Mike B meme that's gonna die. The 2019 ones? Which there are there memes that are specific to 2019? Oh look, we got a doggy versus a dinosaur. Doggy versus dinosaur. Terminal Mother Runes is nice. Hey man, let me ask you something. Mm -hmm. Should I tell people it's your birthday? I think they already know. What? I think they already know. You think they know it's your birthday? I'm like I never know what to say. I'm like, who is it? I don't know. What's going on? All right, let's do it. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Tell Michael I said happy birthday. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'm fucking dying, dude. Oh my god, dude, that's amazing. Wow. Now, wow. I'm, now, I'm, now I'm famous on Moto. <laughs> so real. We literally just talked. You're like, I think people know it's my birthday. I guess they do. So here's a question. Do I risk attacking with Mother of Rune so I can chart a course? Yes. I got one turn. I'll 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 risk it for Labiscuit. 
Creed is good. You know what else is good? Pizza. What kind of pizza? Hawaiian pizza? Nope, that's terrible. <laughs> what about what about Mexican style where you put jalapenos and no. pineapple? No. Mexicans, that ain't Mexican style because Mexican food does not have that many pineapples in it. No, I'm telling you that's like a that's like a thing. It's like a Mexican thing. Shut the hell Pineapples up. and jalapenos. Okay, this is I'm I'm not enjoying things. What can we get with this? I think we can actually just get a forest with it now, right? Let's find out. Or not. I just want to play this. Hit me with your best shot and fire away. Now we will not attack. Because we're not maniacs. Oh, can you imagine if I draw a temporary before they ancestral vision? Because then it won't work, right? Mm-hmm. I can't cast your suspend card as a as a sorcerer, my dude. How's this worm crawl next turn? Yeah. And uh would fall primey not too long after that. God, Mother of Runes is a degenerate magic card. Yeah, scratch your arm. I will. Give it a scratch. That was my wrist. I was scratching specifically. Oh, I didn't know that was. Is that on a part of your arm? They're going to condemn no, this. No, it's not. Yep. Protect. I think we risk it, right? You think the new version is better? That's interesting. I, don't, I think they're both very good. I think they both have their pros and cons for sure. Like, new version is a 1-2. Mother of Runes is a 1-1. One, one. New version can't protect herself. Mother of Runes can. Uh, new version can protect from colorless cards. Mother of Runes can't. So I think there's definitely... I mean, it just depends on the situation. I don't think either one is strictly better than the other. But the fact that the new one even competes with Mother of Runes says a lot. Oh, wow. Did they not... I'm going to crack this now. I don't want to, like... Make sure you get a green. Yeah, it's just obviously forests. Oh. Well. Jolene. Mac B. Mac B. Mac B. I mean, they're definitely countering this, but... What are you going to do? You got to live your life, man. I'd like to give it protection from blue. Imagine if you could do that. Yeah. Target creature or spell you control against protection from the color of your choice. That would be le nuts. Le nuts, as the French say. Well, opponent with eight cards. Now they only got seven, so basically they're fine. They're going to six now. Here comes Big Tef. Gideon Jura. That's pretty good. Too bad we can slam it. Slam it? No, we have to wait another turn to slam it. Not if they slam us. That's from... It's loosely from Spaceballs. You're loosely from Spaceballs? That'd be sick. That's a good Mel Brooks movie. My coworker told me to watch Young Frankenstein. I said that's also a good Mel Brooks movie. You seen that one? I haven't seen all of Young Frankenstein. I've seen most Mel Brooks movies. Is it in like black and white? Wait, what? I'm attacking the Gideon. He had to attack with the mother. Oh, too. wow. All right. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, that's how that works. I was like, wait. Why isn't it working? Oops. I mean, we've got Sun Titan here. I'm not too concerned. But, like, what if they just go, like, oh, God. That whip the board. I 
If they have damnation here or something, it's really super, super bad. I don't think they're going to have damnation. You know what I mean. Why got to be like this? You little dirt burger. All right. Now do you see Mutual? Now do you see? Okay, well they wouldn't do that if they had a Damnation, right? Or a Wrath of God. You know what I'm saying? Stop making me self-conscious about my, my Wrath naming conventions. Well, I'll just stop saying the wrong name and I won't have to. Like, I'm trying to talk about Jolene here. Now do you see Mutual? Do you see? Hey man, you heard of Joe? Joe who? Jolene. Well, I'm surprised I didn't. Surprised I didn't get that. Hmm. Mike, you don't look a day over fifty. Wow. He, it's true. It's true. He doesn't. He looks good for his age. Michael's actually forty-three. <laughs> According to the stream, I'm more like two hundred and seven. Well, you know what they say. A turtle a day lives in a shell. Isn't that Cody and Cough share mixed with grape soda? No, that's lean, not Jolene. Wow. Well, I would have said Joe Mama, but I was, you know, the meme was relevant for that. That's what I was song. waiting for. I was expecting a Joe. I was expecting a Joe Mama. See, a lean is when you mix codeine and cough syrup. I mean, sorry, codeine, cough syrup, and grape soda. Jolene is when your mama does it for you. Wow. Pretty sure scissor and lean are like the same thing. Scissor? Yeah. <laughs> Man, why do you know about all these underground drug combinations, my dude? Because I listen to rap music. Jolene, Mac B. There might be a Mac difference. Jolene, Mac B. Thank you. All right, so what we're going to do is going to go Soul Ring. Super George, thank you for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome. Sorry about that lifelink thing One, yesterday. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Kills Clue, send him a message. I'm not going to do that. Oh, okay. They're going to counter this guy? They probably should. Oh. That's fine. That is fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have 11 mana. We can cast an Ulmog if we had it. Does Mike be really working at a call center? Yes. Every day when Michael gets me a drink, when I ask, I just have to cross my fingers that he didn't poison it that day. Joke's on you. I poison it every day. It's a very slow poison. Wow. It takes about 100 years. So you might live, you might live, uh, buy die for something else first. So. Well, I appreciate that. I, what, can I ask what the point is then? A call center for drugs, wow. Now I work in the fraud department, so I talk to people about fraud on their card. Whatever, Walter White. Potentially save them from getting scammed out of Mucho Buccaneeros. What happened? Yeah, I answer the phone like, oh. hello, this is Mike B. <laughs> Mike B speaking. I'm actually not allowed to give our last name. Is your last name B? That's part of it. Wow. No, I don't make calls out. People call into me. When you when you were born, why did you pick the last name B? Hello, this is the Mike B drug line. How can I get you high today? Wow. Well, answer them. How, Michael? I'll send you one nug of weed. One nug. How much does a nug weigh? What's the official weight of a weed nug? I assume the same thing as a chicken nugget? I don't know. You think a weed nug weighs the same as a chicken nug? Yeah, why not? Man, Fracture Identity is a good card. 
Uh, yeah, yeah. Man, the only good thing we can hit is this tundra, really. Yeah. I guess we can hit a clue. No, they'll crack the clue we don't. Yeah, that's yeah. Don't do that. Because <clears throat> I was like, they can only crack one, so we can just kill the other one. But then, like, that's not Hello, how Hello, this works. is Mike B. Today is my birthday. How can I help you? Wow. How many marijuanas have you injected today, Michael? Seven. How many reefers have, reefers have you tooted? Sausage. Ooh, sausage is a good one. This is a weird attack, man. Well, I was going to give it pro-white. Oh, okay. Never mind. It's a good attack then. But maybe it's not worth it. I'm just afraid of the Sun Titan. What's he going to get back? I don't know. Tundra. Okay. I guess it doesn't matter. Did you hear Felipe dying in there? I did. Is that your mom? No. That was an email. Do you wish it was your mom? Do you ever get sad that she doesn't call you enough? <laughs> mommy! Yeah, she doesn't call me enough. You know it's like twice a day. Mommy! Where are you, mommy? Why do you think I talk like that? Because I've heard you. No. That was a good draw. Yeah, but... I've heard you talk about your mommy. Not like that, yeah. But... Mommy! It's Michael, mommy! This guy's trampling over my dude. Okie dokie. One, two, three. I can believe that Frank doesn't do the electrolytes, but there's no way Mike sleeps that much without some help. You'd think. Oh god, they're picking their modes. They're picking their modes. Checking them twice. Gonna find out who's Teferi or nice. I hate Cryptic Command when I'm not casting it. You and the rest of the world. It's my least favorite thing ever to not cast Cryptic Command. I'm gonna attack Harness, but did Michael B. Oh man. How may I direct your Wednesday, my dude? <laughs> oh man. Oh god. Why, why would you? I cannot believe you have done this. He's making a list. He's Michael it twice. Gonna find out if Michael is nice. He's not. He's terrible. You ever go on an adventure, Michael? What kind? An adventure full of turtles. Then yes. You've gone on a turtle adventure? Yeah. That's crazy. Every day. No, don't fucking lie about Every it. Every day. Where'd you go yesterday? Turtle adventure. That's a what, not a where. Please learn how words work. A what? That is a what you did yesterday. That is not a where. That is not a place. I said turtle adventure. That is not a place. Right. I said, where did you go yesterday? You said oh. turtle adventure. That's not a place. To the ocean. The ocean. Yeah. I went Cuba <laughs> diving in the ocean with the turtles. <laughs> from something Cuba Diving in Ocean yeah that's a uh, bit from um, the comedian that recently died the big dude um, Patrice no no more recent than that um, I don't know any white dude, comedian. big white dude uh, big white dude yeah God, I can't think of his name because you're not very smart wow got him Ralphie May that's it yeah, it's Ralphie did May. Ralphie May die yeah he did John Candy wow, wow that's way before that Chris Farley? Sam Kinison? Well, we traded a Lumbering Falls for a Sun Titan, which I'm pretty okay with. Charlie Chaplin? Turd Ferguson? Okay, that's not a real person. Oh, my bad. Sorry, I didn't make up Charlie Chaplin. <laughs> not land. Oh. 
That doesn't get anything right now. Oh, it's fourther. Fourther? Yeah, when they're at nine, that's big game, Michael. I guess so. Making a list, checking it twice. Revel Ark's gonna go to the graveyard. Michael. Yeah, you get something to get back. Well, if the, now if they wipe the board, we, we get Woodfall Primus, Knight, and Mother of Ruins back, so it's pretty good. He's making a list. He's making a list. The list he's gonna make is a list. List, 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 list. I'm pretty sure you're 100% drunk right now. I think you're absolutely shit-faced. Which is weird, because I didn't see you drink anything. You don't know it's in this mug. He's right, actually. Oh, factor fiction, huh? Uh, can we give them none of these cards? Oh, I want to give them mind. this and this. This comes in play tapped. Mystic Confluence is cool, but like, what do you bounce this guy? Also, we can play around it. I guess if they choose to counter it three times, we can't. But like, this comes in play tapped, so they can't like play the black cards that they're holding on to. And they took Rev Courtyard. Courtyard's good. Mm. What I meant is Rev is good. I guess they're just splashing black. So they can go five, six, seven, eight, nine. They can draw six, then they go to four cards in their deck. Thanks to Ancestral Vision, three clues, and a cryptic command that have been drawn. So it's like seven extra cards plus the five from the Factor Fiction. Which is like 12 cards, but then we've also searched for two lands. And we drew two off a chart, of course. So, I don't know what's going on. Well, that's a problem. Really? Well, no. Because I have really. a Revelark. That's true. <clears throat> well, this guy just blocks it, right? That's unfortunate. Oh, we got Pro Blue. Oh, something's happening. Sphinx is for two. Okay. That does let them live. For now. No, they're no Dobbs. They gained enough life to not be Dobbs. That's a good land to hit. You're right. What if I give them pro white? Can the can the moat not affect them? Give it a shot. Uh, I think I'm good. Do we see anything else worthy of, of disenchant? I think we just saw moat. Yeah, so we can just leave the dis we can leave the disenchant out for now. Michael B is coming to town. Banishing light. Mother of runes. Well, she has no incentive not to target herself here. They're at one life. This is, yeah. We still have Trigon Predator in the main deck too. So, oh, we just went. I was like, I feel like we have a bunch of defenses here. Like they can't wipe the board. They have to deal with two flyers. We can give protection to one of them. Like, are you okay? Are you having trouble staying awake? No. Yeah, I think you are. I mean, that's like 24-7, man. I'm tempted to play Ravages of War. What do you feel about, how do you feel about that? I always like Ravages. They're slow. Yeah, they're slow and dirtily. Seems very good. We could probably cut the... Uh... Yeah, yeah, Woodfall Primus is good. I also like Self of Spirit here because of the Wrath effects. Um, Maybe Master of the Wild Hunt? Yeah, we could probably cut him. Alright, boys, we ravaging. Yeah, boy! Teferi is also a way to bounce the moat. Hey, look, we drew it too. Yeah, I'll keep this. 
That song? No. You don't know that Bob Marley song? No. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. I'm not. Oh. I like that Bob Marley. He sings that ragu. Oh, Jesus. That's a real quote, by the way. No. By one Doyle Brunson. Wow. God, how Doyle Brunson, man. I mean, he's old, so he didn't really know how to pronounce it, I guess. So he just called it Ragu, which is hilarious. Is that hilarious? Yeah. I thought it was pretty funny. I think it was pretty funny. We can Oko into Ravages. That's actually not bad. I think it's insanely good. What are you even try? I think it might be worse now. Can you bounce Planeswalkers? No, but we still get to just play Oko, which is pretty, pretty nuts. Oh no! Boo -doo 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 -doo. We can also banish him like this. Either one's fine, I think. Okay, I think it's a little better if we want to ravage the next turn. The problem is we're gonna make a food token. They're just gonna bounce the food token, draw a card. We're not gonna have any pressure on the board. I like banishing light here. Okay. Oko versus Tefer, yeah, definitely feels standard. You ain't kidding. Are you ready for uh Crypto, Commando. Okie dokie. God, Crypto Command is so broken. It's pretty easy. Who even wrote, who even made that card? But it was Paul Cheon. Unbelievable. Well. Try again. Try, try again. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Can you imagine if we play Teferi next turn and tuck their Teferi? That'd be pretty good. Buddy, I know it. And be Oh, well, that's sad. What are the odds they have... Another counter spell? Yeah. I'm just going to keep on rolling. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Oh, it, it worked again. Well, I'll be. Probably should have bounced again. Well, you know what they say. You might want to consider... Oh, never mind. Just holding lands? Yeah. Well, you know what they say, Michael. Shrub. Yes. Yeah. A poodle and the doodle yeah, drew three cards. is worth mm. two in your schnoodle. I want you to think about it. Okay. One, two, three. Wow. They really want this to ferry. Well, they don't have Mystic Confluence mana, so I think we might be able to get rid of. I think we might just roll to Teferi here. Tuck their banishing. Teferi on Teferi action. It's a hate crime. Hmm. That's fascinating. 
that do anything? I don't know, man. Magic is hard game. Do I need a blue? Do I need a white? Snapcaster. You're remanded? Hmm. Interesting. Okie dokie. Okay, so if we replay this, we get rid of Banishing Light, we get our Banishing Light back. We get Banishing Light this guy. Right? And then they play their Banishing Light. Ugh. You could play Noko here. Like a feed. I suppose we could. And we actually both have five cards. Four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six. Ba -da -da -ba -da -ba -da -da -ba. Hey man, you ready for them burgers later? Oh yeah. I'm gonna get that southern charm. <laughs> Is that a drink? No, it's a it's one of the burgers. It's messed up. Balanced our food token, interesting. Oh, it's Nord. That'd be insane, actually. Oh, that's worse. That is worse. Yeah, Fracture Identity is a hell of a card. Uh huh. That's why I always wanted to take it. Don't think we had a chance this round, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did. I'm pretty sure we've had a chance to take it in every draft. Oh boy. Well, we are not doing great here. You get Sun Titan here? You get to make another 3 3 though. Well, if only I had a land, then I could do another thing. I feel like we're in bad shape here. So now we've seen Banishing Light and Moat. We almost saw like their entire deck the first game, so I don't actually know what the Concealed Courtyard is for. Yeah, we haven't seen a single black card of them yet, so who knows. Not me. That's not sure. sure. No, that, that's going to be a problem. That's not something props can fix. It's going to be a little harder to fix. Okay. Well. Five, six, seven mana. If only we had eight. That'd be real good. I do like eight. I'm tempted to just go Sun Titan, get back. Teferi, bounce like Jace. That seems okay. Hoping that we don't run into the mana leak here. Didn't. Okay. Did not. Get back to Reefy. This is a pretty good little combo. Torifi, Torifi, oh man, like when you talk like that, you make Torifi go mad. <laughs> you know that song? It's from. Uh, I would actually leave it in response to see if you can hit the Mana Leak if you didn't have it, but that's just me. You didn't you show us Mana Leak? Oh, that's. The oh, that might be the, the Concealed Courtyard Splash. Yeah, we saw Mana Leak.
T -t -t today, Junior. T -t 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 today, Junior. This match actually could go down in time. Wow, that was a good hit. All right. Oh, actually, they couldn't even counter that because we have Teferi out now. Oh, yeah. Man, Teferi's broken. That's not a fun... Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, dang it. They no, just... it's not coming down oh, yet. Oh, man, it's so close, though. It's not close. It's literally the second farthest amount it could be, but still. There's, like, a decent chance the game will be over before that resolves. What is... They have seven. We have 13. We're both playing slowish decks, so... Right, but we'd have twice as much time. Oh, you got my mom. Why don't you leave my mother alone? We got Tucker a Titan. Is there a Titan Tucker? Oh, they didn't Tucker Titan. Hmm. I guess they can probably just use Gideon it. Yeah, but that doesn't kill it. True. If we draw a land, we can also go Woodfall Primus, kill Gideon. Oh, they can't do anything. If they pass, like, we're in really good shape because they can't counter anything. Like, they really want to get Tefri off the board, I would imagine. Do we like Cube? Uh, Cube is like the best format ever. Who, who are you? Oh, it's little Jason. Hey. Hey, that's pretty good. I know that you're gonna have it your way or nothing. It's funny, when two Teferis are out, they prevent their own plus ones. I'm moving too fast. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's a really dumb card. One, two, Rip it. three... Four, five, six, seven. I'm not sure I actually care about this. I might be more concerned with this or this. I think we killed Big Teferi. He's very strong. Like, Gideon, like... It's obnoxious, but... I don't think we really care about it, though, right? My, my concern is that they go Jace next turn, flip Jace, and then Fractured Identity on one of our creatures. Oh, that's true. It's real scary. <laughs> Nothing we can do about that, though, right? Not really. Yeah, that's pretty bad. They can even get a free block out of it if they want. Oh, no, guess not. Oh, now they can't flip it yet. They have to do it this turn. That doesn't matter, though. Hopefully they don't see that line. I don't know how they'd miss it, but... Oh, it's definitely possible. We also only have five minutes to win the next game. This game and the next game. We're still at 16, so... Did they do it? Uh, they did use his ability. On. Yep. Fracture identity. Yep. So they fracture our woodfall and then, yeah, and kill our Teferi maybe. That's fine. That's uh, that's not that great. Well, it's the only thing we really can kill. I guess they could kill the colonnade. Colonnade is actually going to be pretty good here. Oh yeah, they can just never mind. Stupid Gideon. 
Uh, too many planeswalkers. Eat these fine. We can Teferi Tuck Woodfall Primus, which seems pretty good. Oh, or we can Swords it. Just don't try to do it at an instant. I'm going to Swords it because they might want to counter this first. This is a nice piece of let's just get Teferi back again, so. Don't go chasing water. Oh, they actually can't miss the Confluence because this cost, it costs one more. It costs six. Oh, yeah. So, unless they have Mana Leak, which I don't care about, because we can still play Mana Leak and... They could have Counterspell, I guess. Well, we've seen most of their deck. Where they, so, we saw Cryptic Command, Remand, Mana Leak, and Mystic Confluence, so... Oh, are they trying? Pay your tithes, my dude. No, oh, so I guess we know they have it. It is tithes day, my dudes. Still pretty terrible that they have that, though. Why? What do we care? Because they can, like, bounce a bunch of our stuff at some point. Here's what we're going to do. One, two, three, four, five. This plays around Mana Leak. We're going to tuck this Gideon. And then we're going to kill both of their Planeswalkers. Seems decent. And get back our own... Attack Teferi, attack Jace. Get back our own Teferi, which is pretty insane here. Do they have something? They have a Condemn? Yeah, that's fine. Still get rid of one of the Planeswalkers, at least. And we do get our Teferi back. What can they bounce? There's nothing that they can really bounce profitably. Um, I kind of want to bounce my own Banishing Light. Yeah, that's And then Banishing Light their Teferi. Okay, so now we know they have Mystic Confluence and nothing in one other card. Nothing. Wow, we time. really destroyed their board. Nothing. This game was over for us. And we have double tefs. Yep, that's all right. So you have Mystic Confluence, one card, and a clue. I'm gonna F six here. Can you do me a favor? Mm -hmm. Can you not go chasing waterfalls? But I love to. They stick to the rivers and the lakes that they're used to, Michael. I don't. Depending on what they do here, we might ravage this next turn. Oh, that's pretty good. We're probably not ravaging. <laughs> I'll, I'll decline. Oh, that's actually pretty insane. I mean, they have two minutes to win two games, so. Yeah. And we also have Celestial Colonnade. We can just nug this thing for 500 damage, draw a card. Also, their, their Ancestral isn't going to hit next turn because of Teferi. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Oh, that's a good one. One, two, three, four, five, right? And then we can activate this attack and then still have Gideon mana. They stick to the rivers and the lakes that they used to. But I'm not moving too far. Oh god, wrong one. <laughs> there be layers if you misclick the ravages. And then we lost. Would we lose? Probably not. I don't think they can even um, win this game. To... You, you don't think what? I don't even think they can get one this game in time. Maybe not. Goodbye, Ancestral Visions! It's so brutal. 
<laughs> I wait four turns and then it doesn't and even then resolve. You get nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to draw three cards. They're asking you not to go chasing waterfalls, but please stick to what you know. Yeah, that's true. Stick to those rivers and lakes that you're used to. That's a terrible message for that song. Why? Because it's like, don't don't try anything. Don't try don't anything new, okay? Mm. What if it's about relationships? Then maybe it's better, unless you're in a really bad relationship, then it's not better. Well. Who won? Yay. Only took us nine hours. Nine hours? Felt like it. It felt like a lifetime. I love every time I post an article on Facebook, I post my cool stuff article on Facebook, which went up today, so go check it out. Coolstuffinc.com. It's called A Pioneer Reckoning. And uh, every time an article, I post an article on Facebook, and I'm like, leave a comment in the article because it's great for engagement and it looks like the, the article's doing well. Uh, I always get like 10 comments on the Facebook post and like three comments in the article. I'm like, why? Well, I mean, in theory, maybe they still wouldn't read the article, so you still got the traffic for it. It doesn't change anything. We're going to play turn two Oko like standard. Hopefully that'll be good enough. Or we can play turn two temporary like standard. I guess it depends on what they do. I guess we're not gonna play that on turn two. Just read your article. I just wanted to stop by the stream and comment that I really enjoyed it. Oh, Phil, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. God, he's been here the whole time and he knows it. Like they give me a call on the phone. And they're like, "Hey, man, I just want to know. I saw your article on Facebook, and I uh, really liked it. So I'm gonna leave a comment here. Thanks. All right. See you later. You gonna play that bouncer, bro? Yeah. Doesn't mean you might die, but how? They got nothing on board. All right, questing beast next turn. Just gonna like bolt it or something. They're Okay, but Base then red. I already drew a card. I'm just saying, it's probably dead. Why are you so negative? See, look. That's it's a dead. <laughs> That's not how that works, Moochel. <sighs> okay, I don't care about any of these creatures. Pretty sure it's just questing beast here. I'm just playing standard, guys. Shut up and take my money. Oh, what happened? Oh, one th ten thousand victims of Shrek. <laughs> Do you not remember that? No. Can someone link that in the chat, please? Holy shit! Someone, please, please link that in the chat because I have no idea where I would be able to find it. Oh my god, I have no idea how to ever find that. Uh, the rest of the message was... Holy Cube, what a dick. Also, hi Mike, hope you're enjoying your millionth birthday. Love to see Shrek in prison, by the way. <laughs> Look, they have to main phase... Oh, shit. They have to main phase their, their cards, because... Clearly their storm. Figure that much All right, out. well, we'll give them Thousand Year Storm and Time Walk over here, and then their Rituals over here. How does that sound? Seems like a good split. Mediocre Magic Man, if that's true, then that's cool. I just do it because, like, it just helps. I don't know. It just it looks better. Like, if you have an article from an author and the article has a thousand comments on it shrek the killer affinity god damn you are the fucking clip master my dude are you ready for this how many people do you think how many people do you think shrek is <laughs> at least ten thousand. 
That, you don't remember that? No. At least 10,000. You were talking about how Shrek is a murderer. I don't remember that at all, man. Oh, my God. That's like 10,000 victims of Shrek is hilarious. <laughs> okay, so they get to nug Ted. Uh, there's too many memes, man. I can't remember them all. Well, that's your fault, isn't it? Don't blame other people for your problems, I didn't, I didn't blame anyone else. Don't do it. <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog is a murderer. Sure Jesus. Nick the Herge Herge. God, Shrek is a murderer. How many people do you think Shrek has killed? At least 10,000. <laughs> <laughs> 10 fucking thousand people. Do you know how many people that is? Uh, it's about 10,000. It's exactly 10,000. <sighs> how come this doesn't have reach? Because it doesn't have any arms. Live action Sonic the Hedgehog is almost certainly a mass baby murderer. What does that mean? Okay, I'm gonna have to read this later. My dude. I'm not. I don't care. Eureka's Castle. Remember that song? I was singing it. Do you remember me singing that song? Just shut up, man. <laughs> Why are you like this, man? Why are you such a jerk? All right, don't counter, don't counter, don't counter, don't counter. I don't think I don't think a storm deck is gonna have too many counters, but boy, am I gonna be wrong. Usually don't. Boy, am I gonna be wrong with the oh, sweet elk bra. This guy's gonna get big there, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. What does this do? They're gonna factor fiction response. Sure. Shrek definitely killed that boy he loved. What? You know, his boy lover. <laughs> <laughs> that does not sound okay. Well, it's not. It's, he murdered him, too. I don't know if you know that. Uh, impulse. Land. Land. Sure. Mountain Island Impulse. M I Impulse. Orit Thing. Orit Thing! Hi Frank, I know you love cube, but what would you think was the worst cube format would be? What do you think the worst cube format would be? Mountain Island. Okay, so cool. So another hand is these three. Mono green here. cube. Okay, so next time we can go Sun Sun Titan and a Teferi, which is pretty cool. Which doesn't that shut down Thousand Year Storm? No, maybe not. I don't know how that works. Magic is not if they play with sorcery, they don't. Not if they play my sorcery, they don't. Not if they play my sorcery, they don't. Hey, you. No, you love me. No. Our friendship is true. True. It's true. Our friendship is true. It is. It's true as true can be, Michael. That's a Michael Caine. You know Michael Caine? That was terrible. Master Wayne, why do we fall down? To get back up, Master Wayne. <laughs> it's actually really bad really bad impression Michael listen I want you to listen to Michael Michael Caine I'm Michael Caine can you listen to Michael Caine I, 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 I can't be here Master Wayne if you can't if you keep hurting yourself remember that when he was like he was leaving shut up <laughs> Are you okay? No. Is our pain? Is our friendship painful for you? It is. Yeah. Very. It is very. It sounds like Michael Caine with peanut butter in his mouth running from a murderous <laughs> Shrek. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what they say: old peanut butter cane is better than none. I guess. Uh, yeah. Let's use this. Better than peanut butter Wayne. Peanut butter Bruce Wayne? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna bounce your your little bird friend. Oh, that's a that's a next turn woodfall primus. God damn. You know who that is? Is that Towley? I believe so. Remember that show Just South Shut part? up. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus 
Christ. Woo! Just shut up. Okay. Nobody cared about that. I have a questing beast. Oh, they hit a demonic tutor with no black sources. <laughs> Just shut up. <laughs> you can tell the moment Mike has... He's like, nope, I'm done, man. I am done, my dude. So we just Woodfall Prime with this Narset. Woodfall Prime it. Sun Titan being able to get back with Teferi and Oko is pretty insane, right? Like, I don't care about your stupid little bird. Stupid little bird. Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> what's, what's wrong with you? Who knows? Oh, speaking of banishing like this guy. Why attack would do that? because then we can attack their face. They can't block this. You don't like that? Yeah, sure, why not? And we can also play the rag task. One, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, that's good. Because then we just get to kill Narset. Three is Michael B2. Murder, murder, murder. Attack your face, attack your face. Attack in your face, attack in your face, attack in your face. Get a no go. Oh, go, smoke, go, no joke, go. This is a song I just wrote. Ogo Smoko no Joko. It's all true. It's true. All of it. What's that from? What are you from? I don't know. Give me that life. Turn your little bird into nothing. So we know four of the five cards in your hand. You have an Electromancer. No, we, no, we know three. We actually did not give you the Electromancer back. We bound, we, uh, we banished it to the Shadow Realm. Suntime returning Oko is pretty spicy. Suntime returning Teferi is also pretty spicy. And Mike was like, I don't think we're going to play Sun Titan. That was before we were base white. Was it? Yeah. Just shut up. I don't feel like they're going to win this game, but I, I appreciate their their dedication to it. Woodfall Primus. It's not so bad if you have a flashlight. I hear that. Buddy, I hear that. Mike lives in the Shadow Realm. You know, Mike is just hanging out in his bedroom. He doesn't turn the light on. He just sits there in the dark. It's real yeah. weird. I like the darkness. It's so weird. They're really thinking it over here. We have lethal on board, so. I didn't even press anything that switched me to another streamer. Mucho, please explain your ignorant magic that made this happen. Wow. Okay, so we know three of the four cards in your hand now that Lotus is gone. You can play Thousand Year Ritual. Does Mike snore? Boy, do I. Oh, Jesus, it's nightmarish. You can hear it from like a mile away. I like that they're like, I'm going to play Black Lotus. Concede. All right, Scoop. So what's good here? Disenchant. is okay. Hmm. That's about it. Yeah, and then we have plenty of answers, so I don't think we need to. Which Titan is your favorite? Um. God, it's hard. I know my answer. I 
What's your answer? Grave Titan. Is it Grave Titan? Mm-hmm. It might be. You know what? It prevents snoring a CPAP machine. Uh, Mike should probably get one of those. That'd be sick if you got one. You should go to the doctor and see if they can recommend a CPAP machine to you. Did you when when did, how how did your recheck go when you went to the doctor to get it to get it updated to see what they said? Cuz it's been like 2 months, so I feel like that's enough time to to just go to the doctor, right? So how how did that go? Well. Went well. It went well. What did he say? He said zoom 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 all up in your boom boom. Hmm. Interesting. CPAP machines change people's lives. They get so much better sleep. Wow. That's crazy, dude. But Mike is like, no, nah, that's uncomfortable. I'll rather live miserably and uh, keep snoring and keep being unrested. And, uh, you know, just because it's, it's kind of uncomfortable a little bit. You say that, but it's just not easy to get to sleep. I mean, yes, and everyone says that and they still deal with it and they still... And then they still do it. Because <laughs> it's like, that's life. You got to do it. Or go to the doctor, like you said you would, for like the past month and a half, and just talk to him and be like, hey, it's not super comfortable. How can I get this fixed? Michael B., life is uncomfortable. I'm sure you get used to it. Hey, man, I don't know what to tell you, dude. Like, it's... You ain't got to tell me nothing. I clearly do, because you don't do anything on your own. <laughs> It's just frustrating as your friend to watch you make these bad life decisions. And no matter how much I prod, it doesn't do anything. It's even worse because they're all alternatives to CPAP machines. Oh, and this, this is what drives me crazy about you. You acknowledge that you made a dumb choice. And then you like kind of like you advocate against yourself by telling me that, you know, like because you're not like even like there's uh there's this thing you can get that like it uh, it goes under your pillow. And like whenever it senses your uh like a certain way your uh, neck goes it like moves your head a little bit which opens up your airway which makes you stop snoring that sounds insane yeah it's like it's you have to charge it it's like battery based but there's also um, this thing you can buy that you put in your mouth and it like basically just keeps your mouth open so you, you can't snore like it just keeps your mouth open wide enough it's got like a hole in it so you just breathe through that and I think there's like one other thing you can get why haven't you fucking just gone to the doctor man <laughs> like what's up what do you get out of that Ugh. I'm so tired of you being a lazy piece of shit. Hold on. Drilling sinus cavities. What's that about? Oh, you know. I don't actually. Drill those sinus cavities. I'm gonna just play Oko no Shmoko. Hope it's okay with you. Oh no, I have a CPAP machine. I just don't use it. He literally has it already. It's in his room and it's been there for like two to three months. Friends, man, they're so frustrating. Boy, you are right. Mike's reasons. What's that? Let's find out. I'm still a piece of garbage. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh Jesus. Yeah, he's definitely tried it. Yeah, I've tried. To, I've tried it for like. I've tried it like 10 or 10 times maybe. Did they miss a land? Oh, they missed one land. I've tried to get to sleep with it like 10 times and I just haven't been able to. 10? That's it? In two months? Yeah, about 10 times, yeah. And you got... You need to get your life together, Michael. No, I have a regular doctor and I think my co pays zero because of my insurance. Yeah, there's no, there's literal no excuse other than I don't want to get out of bed and go do it. Which the irony is that a sleep hat machine might actually help with the depression and the restfulness. So like, it's very possible that him just going to the doctor and getting this checked out would 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 be the motivation to get him checked. Like it's such a, it's like it's just cyclical. You, you know what I mean? You want to know another reason? Oh God, here we go. Yeah, according to the doctor, it can actually help you uh, lose weight as well. Yeah, I remember you telling me that. Yeah, this is funny because like this is what you do though. You never like. <laughs> 
defend yourself. You're never like, well, no, man, I this way I haven't done, this way I haven't done, this way. Uh, well, because I what know you I'm do not is right. Actually, you encourage me. I'm not going to say I'm not right. You give I'm me. I'm not going to say I'm right. I'm not going to defend that. I'm clearly wrong. Well, you, want me to, you want me to go to the doctor with you? No. I'll go. We'll go together. That's not going to help. Come on, Michael. We'll go together. <laughs> I think I'm good. Four, five, six. I'm just going to make, gonna make assumptions about us, and I don't want it. <laughs> I could rub your back while you're filming. <laughs> you're you signing in. <laughs> this is my son. This is my son, Moochel. He lives with his... I don't think that's the assumption they were going to make, but... Oh, this is my... <laughs> I want to say it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, Lord. Her at Mike B, don't make me come out there and take you to the doctor. Yeah, like the day after we go to Disney, everyone's like, okay, now we have to get... Well, I'll go to the doctor with Mike. Oh, my God. That would be like, <laughs> that's our Tuesday trip. Wow, that was a turn two Oko that just want us to get... Wow, this is... So we're 4-0 right now in this draft with this crazy Bant deck. I'll tell you what. I'll try it again tonight. Okay. I promise. I'll try it. How about this? If you don't, if it doesn't work, make an appointment in the next week to go to the doctor. Okay. I could do that. I'll go with you. No, that's okay. I'll wait in the car. <laughs> I'll have the, I'll just listen to my music. That's weird. Also, the doc. Do you know how close my doctor is? Oh my fucking god! This is what you he does. How close he is. He, he emphasizes how ridiculous he is. Let me. Let's. How many miles do you think it is? Four. Do you know where? Um. Where's the? Oh, bro, is it? <laughs> oh, bro, is that? Actually, let's find out right now. I will play first. Oh, turn to Gideon? Oh, wow. I, I just got here and I already know he should go. <laughs> everyone's, everyone's supportive of you, man. That's the thing. Everyone's in your corner, man. Why does it put my dad. doctor in the K section? I guess because it was first name. That's weird. In the K section, is his name Christopher with a K? It's Karadesh. It's hard to say. Oh, I didn't activate my Gideon after I cast it. That was cool. I F6 because I had I was listening to I was making jokes. It's unfortunate. It's okay. Well, that questing beast is not coming down anytime soon. I'm getting rid of that though, because I don't like it. We are all in your corner with your trash juice. If the CPAP is uncomfortable, you should ask to get it adjusted. Maybe get a different mask for it. Yeah, there's lots of options. It's not uncomfortable to wear. It's the breathing process that's uncomfortable. Uh, it's four minutes away. You want to see the map? Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> you could walk there. I could. How? Let me see. Hold on. Let me see where it. It's off of uh. What the road is that? Uh, Belcher. It's like right before that shell. It's gas a. It's one Belcher. mile away. It's one point eight miles away. Sweet baby Jesus, Michael. Sweet baby Jesus, ba -ba -da. going to the doctor soon. I like when people at Mike BU, like, you're going to get that message. <laughs> if you really want to tag me, you'd have to use O Mac O. But then you're not in the but chat either. The chat. But I, I, I mean, it still highlights it. Like, it, it's it's big letters, so. It's big letters. Oh, God, don't play Questing Beast Girl. Let's figure out practically anything we talk about here should just be discussed with a doctor, like the one you should be seeing. Well, I did go see my other doctor the other day. That was my psychiatrist, not my, uh, my like, regular doctor. Yeah, did they say, Michael, you should really go see your regular doctor? Well, they don't know As anything. a medical professional. They don't know anything about my sleep breathing. You don't know about my dad. <laughs> Michael, I do. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, nobody cares about that. Thank you. Whoa. What the fudge? Badger's like... Oh, the fuck? Yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. 30 Thank gifted you. subs. Badger hit the 500 gifted sub goal. Jesus, God. This is going to be ridiculous. 
Oh Thank my you. god. Can you scroll up a little bit? Oh, Jesus. Uh, so when Thank I you. So I don't actually know how the machine works. What do you mean when you say breathing process uncomfortable? So, like, basically what the machine does is it, Thank you. It's, it's hooked up to your nose, like, like, it goes over your nose like this, and it, like, it goes in and out. Like, as you breathe, it breathes with you, but it, like, it you. makes you take deeper breaths, which is the point of it. Which you're supposed to do, yeah. It's just hard to get used to that process because it's not, it's not, like, natural. Thank you. So it's just hard to get used to. But everyone says it's hard to get used to. A different mask so. made a huge difference for me. Hmm. Mike, we joke a lot, but it's legit because we care about you. Yeah, it's true. Now you can scroll down. Okay. Thank you. It's true. I have tons of friends where I'm like, yeah, come over, stream. I don't give a shit. You do what you want to do, man. If I didn't care, dude. Thank you. I wouldn't. I have better things to worry about. I think we're losing. I think you're losing. Thank Loser. you. Teferi, Oko, Dag Tusk. Thank you. I feel like these thank yous are going to be going on for a long time. We're at Bukaka right now. Which is, oh god, that's way up Thank there, you. 100 emotes share. Our Badger's gift shared rewards to 100 others in Thank chat. Thank you. Mike, you should be going to your pediatrician. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I'm still young enough for that. I know, buddy. I know. I wish getting cost three so that I can get him back with Sun Titan. Thank you. Well, he don't. You're right, he don't. Scroll on Thank you. Let's get Mike be a doctor's appointment for his Thank birthday, you. guys. I don't know what to do here. Thank you. Do I just attack with this dude? I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Thank you. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, I'm so sorry about the thank yous. Uh, on YouTube, you guys really don't seem to mind these thank yous, so. Thank you. Badger, you are unreal, dude. Thank you so much. God, 500 gifted subs is an also, unreal I have amount. To, I have to call my doctor regardless because I'm, I gotta you. get more uh, medicine. I gotta get a refill for that. Yeah, is that for your for your erectile dysfunction? Thank no, you. For my, uh, for my high blood pressure. It's erectile dysfunction. Well, you're, you only get high blood pressure because Thank you're you. upset about your erectile dysfunction, so. <laughs> it's all connected, my dude. I'll have you know my erectile functions just well enough. Why didn't you play Sun Titan? Thank you. Um, well, I mean, it's not like I haven't been playing other things, and also Sun Titan doesn't get anything back, so. I mean, it's not like I'm, like, losing a ton of value. It's Thank just the 6-6. Six, six. Like, I played Gideon instead on one turn, and I played Questing Beast on one turn. Like. Thank you. All right, we're Caliban. How close are we? All right, we got like three more guys. We're almost done with the thank yous. Badger, you are awesome, dude. Does Badger own you? Yeah, it's close. Badger has definitely contributed to a good source of thank my income you. this year, and I appreciate him very, very much. Yeah, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to pay him uh, taxes. Thank you. Really need to get rid of this Avenger. Yeah, it's not good. I definitely wish I had more ways to do it. I'm gonna attack. Gonna get out of control. Because if you want to block with the Avenger, that's one thousand percent fine with me. He did not. Yes, Josh and Badger are both uh, top tier supporters, and you guys are awesome. I like that they don't have a land on top though. So what do they draw? They draw Mystic into or Fellows. That's really good. Being able to dodge a land here, presumably, is hot. Badger and I are both shareholders in Frank LeCorp. What if we all moved into a big house and made sure we each got the medical care we needed? Wow. Oh my god. Socialist commune, go! <laughs> Welcome, brother. Oh god, did they just draw five here? Why did they take so long to play that? Because that's pretty nuts. Why did you use that welcome, brother? Why did you use that like Russian voice? Because we're a commune. 
We're communists. We're socialists, Michael. Don't confuse the two. Like Look, the Bobby thing. Butter's Buttery Biscuits is here. Nice. This stream is sponsored by Badger, my dudes. Oh, wow. They just didn't draw five? I would have drawn five. Yeah, hitting a land seems good for them. I like that everyone in the chat who wants medical care, they're like, they're all we're all Americans. Everyone in other countries is like, what are you guys oh, talking I just, about? I, yeah, it's are free. you guys okay? I talking about. Do you guys really need help? Can't you just go to the doctor? Well, you see. No. Yes. That's one of the reasons I'm reluctant to get a new job is because they usually have to wait a couple months before the insurance kicks in, which is a really brutal. Pretty brutal. Pretty pretty brutal. Pretty brutal. Who's pretty brutal? Is that your friend? Yes. Oh, that's old pretty brutal. Fresh friend, pretty brutal brutal. Is it? Yeah. Attack. Hey man, why don't you get sun time? You can get back your path to exile. It's pretty good actually. It's sword supply shared though. Yeah, it's true. You can just go to the doctor or the emergency room, but, like, you'll just be in debt forever. Jokes on you, RDM. <laughs> oh, my God, yes. Oh, wow, we get to kill their Garrick? Oh, Lord. Oh, that was great. Wow, I think they forgot about that. Probably. Oh, buttery biscuits. One, two, three, four, five, six. Sunny boy. In California, they have a sort of intern plan where you're between jobs. Does Florida have anything like that? I don't think so. They got the movie rolling. Passing the you have this part of our prison system, Mike. We can't move employment and it keeps us working. God bless America. Yeah. Oh, Primus on top is good. Uh, they played the Mystic. They played their fellows. They have no cards in hand? Jeez, we're actually doing okay. Pro green, pro blue. Come on, give me something good. Give me my own Woodfall Primus. I don't have three green. Don't give me Woodfall Primus. Give me... Also, to try to find another job Asian that's light, decent, temporary. that pays 16 an hour, plus has good health care and vacation, just seems like an absolute grind. Raise the roof thicket. Oh, boy. No, sir, I don't like it. You can pay Cobra to extend your health care for $1 billion. Yeah, pretty much. Cobra's Cobra! Worse. Cobra might as well actually be Cobra from friggin... G.I. Joe. Yeah. 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 And things are looking so good. I actually wish I, um... I should have made an emblem because I forgot the Woodfall Primus is only going to probably kill the... Uh, like, B, you could aim higher, like, a job that has all those things and pays more than 16 an hour. That's tr That's possible. Oh, yeah. I work at uh, All Rose Steel, and there's a few of those in Florida. I don't know what that is. Give me more deets. Deets. Oh, here we go. They're going to go Woodfall Primus Land Land, and then it's just going to be burnt. Okay. Start out at 15 or 16 now with your benefits. Go on. What do you do there? What's. It also would have to be close. Like, if it's in, like, Orlando, Florida, it doesn't work. Yeah. It literally has to be in this area. I'm looking the job would have to be California. really good for me to drive to Orlando every day. <laughs> I have to be making like 25 an hour. I think even then you wouldn't do that. For 25 an hour? Yes, I would. You'd drive to Orlando every day. For 25 an hour? Totally. Wow. 25 an hour is no joke, dude. That's insane. Maybe. Maybe not. I mean, it'd be a brutal back and forth, but... Buddy, you won't even go to the doctor that's one mile away. <laughs> you can go to Orlando every day? Please. No land. What if you tried showing up to work on time? Okay, recently I have been pretty good about that. <laughs> He's actually been real good about it for the past like month or so. Uh, yeah, I've actually been super impressed. Then try to get promoted to management. Then you can continue to show up to work whenever you want. Wow. So that's not be lazy to get promoted. Then then I can be lazy again because I'm a manager and I'm a salary so I can show up late. It's all well, part no, of the privilege. I think it's because you get the privilege of being able to do that because you're a manager. So like you get to make your own hours, really? Be on lazy so you can be more lazy. Well, I'm pretty sure my... Cause my uh, well, look at me. Like I get to start my stream pretty much whenever I want. Like... 
I can no, what I was mom. saying is my actual manager just rarely ever shows up on Sundays and just works from home because she can do that. Yeah. And that probably involves doing barely nothing, is my guess. Could be wrong. I don't really know for sure, but You'll never she know. doesn't show up on Sundays a lot. Goodbye, Sol Ring. That's the American way. It's true. The only thing I hate about my job is to move forward, you have to learn some other stuff, which is fine. The problem is they don't actually pay you for learning the other stuff. Unlike every other job, they're like, oh, now you can take these type of calls, so you, so you have to go through this training. And you're like, great, so that, that means I get like a pay bump, right? Nope, you don't get paid anymore. So you have to learn all these different things and all these different calls, but you don't actually get paid more until you actually get promoted, which is super silly. Maybe you don't. And it makes the job much harder. Got him. Did you try setting the building on fire? <laughs> How would that help me? That would just make me lose my job. Yeah, but then your vengeance is sated. Wow. So, you know, everybody wins, right? Mike, be a serious question. Uh, but how would you feel about processing medical claims remotely for a company I work for? 12 weeks of virtual training with great benefits and starting wages at 20, 20, 22 50 an hour. Customer service as claim backgrounds is helpful, but not necessary. Uh, that sounds totally fine. So it's remote, so you can like, work from home. Get to survive. Yeah, Cabal, and if that's a real if that's a real opportunity, I bet Mike would be on board with that. Faux show. Yeah, that sounds legit. I mean, I'd love to work from home and just have to not actually put on pants. <laughs> oh dear God, please don't give him an excuse to be naked all the time. It's in my room, man. Yeah, it's not the same. Hello, this is Michael. I'm naked. How can I help you? Oh. <laughs> I don't know about fighting Frank over the internet, though. It wouldn't... It would, I would just be... I don't need to, like, upload anything. Yeah, he's not doing, like, hardcore streaming or anything. That just sounds like document stuff and data entry and stuff. I'm wearing pants. Good Lord. <laughs> I wear pants whenever I'm in the house. That's just how it works. Come on. Let me dress like Tefri or something. Yeah, come on. Uh... Shoot your email to Frank or something, or... Come on, send me an email at frank at franklapore.com. I'd definitely be interested in that. Oh, thank God, I just Yes, asked you work that. from home, you would need to come here for orientation and meet and greet, but after that, you would be set for workstation with us, testing internet speed, and you'd be good to go. I can send you an email. Well, you said you had to need to come here for orientation. Where is this place at, though? My dad's. That I would need to come to. Oh, you know. Just send me the, send me an email with all the details. Because if it involves, like, taking a plane trip, that might... <sighs> yeah, that's pretty good. If, if it involves taking a plane trip, you're, like, out, out for $22 an hour, really? You would literally drive to Orlando every day for work. But if you have to take one plane trip for a $22 an hour job, it's like, hmm, that might change my mind. Where you get to work from home. <laughs> Maybe you raise a good point. Okay. I guess they get to draw nine here. That's terrifying. Yeah, I guess twenty two fifty is probably worth it for one place. Yeah, trip. it's literally two dollars less than the amount the amount you were gonna drive to Orlando every day for. Let's see what the difference is. Like find out the difference in pay. Between now and then? No, like the difference between hold on. So it'd be 6.5 more bucks an hour, which is pretty good. So times that by 80 for two-week checks. So it'd be $520 more every paycheck. That's pretty good. How much more paycheck? 520 before taxes. Yeah, it's like an extra $1,000 a month. Yeah, it's pretty good. A month. Cabal, and send me that email info if you're being serious, because I'm sure that would actually be pretty sweet for Mike. Our St. Paul facility in Minnesota, but if you pass the video interview, you'd be flying out on our dime yeah oh, they're not wow. gonna, yeah they're not gonna force you to pay for a flight for an interview like like when bethesda flew me out to interview with them they paid for my flight they paid for my hotel they had a car pick me up from the hotel and bring me to bethesda like it was like the most legit serious job interview i've ever had and 
I'll forward the email to you when I get home tonight. Thanks. Appreciate it. That sounds sounds pretty good. I feel like we want moat, but they also have Woodfall Primus and Acidic Slime, so... Oh, God. Also, that makes the potential in the future for me to not have to live in Florida, which I also like. You? Leaves my options open, yeah. What about what about your mommy, though? What about little mommy, Michael? This is a Linvala deck for sure. Michael, it's your mommy. I just want to talk to you all the time. <laughs> you can still talk to her. That's what phone calls are for, man. Is that what they're for? Yeah. I don't know, man. I just work here. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I'm working California. Feeling Minnesota. Oh, yeah. I'm take Tide to take her out, and I gotta do shit. What did you bring in? I brought in Linvala. Okay. Um, I think we definitely keep this hand. Uh, yeah, it's got a soaring in it, so I'm pretty much on board. I'm pretty much I'm back game. Don't know if you're gonna do it. Don't say you're not gonna do it. I'm not listening. I'll try, dude. I'll try and get stuck in my head. All of the time. I don't think I've ever heard Outshine. Oh my god, are you serious? I've sung it like 30 friggin' times. Really? It's like one of my favorite Soundgarden songs. Also, I think one of the reasons Outshine gets stuck in my head because it was literally on a soundtrack for a game. Road Rash for the old... Uh, I think it was a Genesis video game. Sing some of it. I'll just... Here, hold on. Let me, let me pause the recording. I'll just play it real quick. All right. Um, so we have a million. That's a turn. Stop this MTG and download a ROM when you guys, so Mike and you can play Road Rash together. That's hilarious. So what do we have? We have four total mana this turn. It's not good enough, but we can play Sword. Against the mono green deck? Come on, dude. Turn two Sword against mono green deck? I'm game. Frank, is Red Robin what you call the doctor so Mike B will actually go? Wow. <laughs> Come on, Mike. Time to go to Red Robin. Oh, wait. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven mana. So we can play Teferi and equip. Uh, but with him, we can't attack. It doesn't matter. We're just attacking here. Yeah, I'd rather just end the game. I feel like the sword's just going to win this the game. Win thus the game. Yeah. They're going to win thus the game. Okay, so we we got Woodfall Primus, Woodfall. Avenger, Terastodon. We got a lot of their threats. That's a good that's a good hit, my dude. Put it on my little wolfie boy. Can you smear some peanut butter on the CPAP before he goes to bed? <laughs> what would that do? Like a dog. If I smear some peanut butter on it, then you'll be more oh, inclined yeah, to, sure. to use it. You'll really appreciate it. Once a month, get together with old coworkers and playing Commander Potluck. Whole deal. If some, if some Cornell doesn't come on on the music player, it just doesn't feel right. Hmm. Yeah, I, I miss Chris Cornell every day. Look at that cat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Give me another ten cards, will you? Sword of Body and Mind is a broken sword against Mono Green Deck. My brother shot a movie with Chris Parnell in it. Who's Chris Parnell? I don't even know who that is. What did we hit this time? There's the Crater Hoof. Green Sun. Or Fellows. Alright, well, we're getting a look at this whole decorino. Yeah, I think that'll probably seal the game. Sure. Like, if they didn't have a play last turn, they're not going to have a play this turn, so. Uh, 
Oh, this game is the finals. And Mike is in the trash can. Oh, yeah. Chris Parnell is an actor and voice actor. You have heard him on Archer, for example. I probably know him if I heard him. Yeah, for sure. Frank, how much do we need to raise for a music stream? What the hell is a music stream? I'm guessing a stream where you can play music. You want me to sing? I'm just looking in the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you got to be weird about it? That's just how I sound, okay? You're really hurting my feelings. Can we get anything with this now? Oh, fuck. This is just a blank land, I think. That's a mulligan. Right? Hmm? Huh? Can we can't, we can't get anything with this delta, right? You can get an island, right? We don't have an island. We literally del we tried not to get the island. Was there only two island based dual lands? Well, we don't have we don't have breeding pool. We don't have hollowed fountain. Mm hmm So yes. Okay, we're definitely bouncing that idiot. I am Torifi of the Torifi clan. I am the best Torifi. Also, double green, double green, double green. We have one green source and a polluted delta in hand. This is actually the most awkward land situation ever. What up, Swenny boy? One Swenny boy. Green source one time would be nice. Also, we can just Oko this guy, so. Oh, we did it. I really don't want them to have this guy, though. I'm pretty sure it's still Okoing this guy. One, two. Michael B. Lives in the tree. So what, they get like 10 mana next turn if they play a land? We can't allow that. I'm sorry. <whistles> Come on, Lando. Lando Calrissian. Alan Yee is uh, is a dude who constantly uh, comments on my YouTube videos. He's a really, really sweet dude. And he just commented, Frank, I got five on it. Mike. Oh, no. Frank Frank says, I got five on it. You know that song? Mike sings, I got five on it. Frank, I don't know that song. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much how it went, I think. I got five on it. Is it Master of the Wild or is it Questing Beast? Master can't block either of these guys. Questing Beast can block both of them. Uh-huh. But we are at 20, so... Well, they're going to kill Teferi, which means they're inclined to attack. Plus, this guy's not doing a ton. I'd rather just play Questing Beast here. I mean, they have eight mana still. God. So much land. Are you playing the piano? Yes. That's cool, man. I'm really proud of you. Also known as the drums. The, the drum piano? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm What a time to be alive. I know, right? Oh, they're beast within my Teferi. You could have just killed it either way. That's weird. I guess this saves their Magai, but... Their Magai? Magai. Have you ever been to the land of Magai? No, I don't know what that is. I got five on it, though. <laughs> do you... Do you have five on it, Franklin? I do, Mitchell. One, two, three, four, five. 
Four, okay. six, seven, eight. If we had three green, we can play both of these. If we had eight mana, we can play both of these. But instead, we can only play one card this turn, and that just makes makes me a sad jingleberry. We have no way to kill this, so that's off the table. Uh, I think we just play this and see what we hit off of the Vivian Reed. Slam that Viv and be done with it. We did. And if we draw like Selfless Spirit. Wow, we are good at this game. I'm tempted to attack and then crack Spirit if they block with Thrag Tusk. I'll probably just take it. Because then we're trading Selfless Spirit for Thrag Tusk, which is totally fine. Taking it's fine. I accept. That's a good little dance you had there. Thank you, my dude. Oof. That's pretty cool. Killed Vivian and two of his own lands. I got five. That's fine. Hmm. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two. Of course, we need four green, so we can't play everything. One, two, three, four, five, six. Still play Trigon plus Master, right? Yeah. Do, 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 do. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have we can cast anything in our deck. I mean, it's only six mana, so they're not like it's not super close to. No seven. Oh, they can't activate Rafellus. Yeah, Rafellus is not a Rafellus. Even if they could, this isn't going to give them eight. This isn't going to give them one extra mana. It's going to give them four. Yeah, I mean four plus the land is eight, right? Right, but then this is three more. Oh, okay. So it's eleven. Damage shouldn't be prevented with indestructible. No, it's not. Damage is still dealt. It just creatures can't die due to lethal damage. That's why trample still works. If they don't die. Brett, I think that's why I like cube. I think I think a lot of cube games feel like low power versions of Commander. I mostly just hope Mike gets hired to work with me so I can wish him a happy birthday at each unit meeting. Wow. They got Rashad in port back? I would have totally gotten Beast within back and Beast within my questing Beast. Beast for a Beast. And then, like, because this guy's holding back your 9-9. Nine -nine. And then they could probably, like, alpha with everyone. Unless they're just holding Crater Hoof and then we just get to get wrecked. Unless we draw Sword of Fire and Ice here, that'd be gas. It's not terrible. It does not prevent a Crater Hoof from... Doing us dirty though. We could swords this and get in there for four. It's the only thing really preventing us from attacking. They could like block with a bunch of dudes though. We can also just wait, like we're gaining the advantage with the, with the master. master. Yeah. We do have to worry about I'm like, worried about Crater Hoof. We might just be dead yeah. if they Crater Hoof. Oh, we're definitely dead if they Crater Hoof. Mm. That's not even close. How not sword the three mana dude? Oh, this guy? Yeah, it's we actually that's actually a good point. We probably should. Yeah. Yeah, they can double block with Beast, but like I'm just more concerned with getting multiple creatures off the board. Yeah, I think we just lost because we didn't actually do that, so that's unfortunate. Yep. Yeah, Chris. I mean, you can Swords in response to the 9-9, nine -nine, but I still think it's probably lethal. We could just attempt it, I guess. We can get Swords and shoot like a, another guy, and then they get... They have one... 
two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. So they're all getting, they have, they'll have one, four, five attackers that are all getting plus six, plus six, so it's 30. Well, I think we're still dead. <laughs> yeah, even if we survive this attack, it's going to wreck our whole board, so... Yeah, we should have just killed the other guy. Let's see if that would have that would have saved us. Like, they would have had less, significantly less mana. Yeah, they only would have had, a, like, six mana. We would have drawn Charter Course. We could have just played it. Discard the Polluted Delta. Drawn two. Um, the next turn, we would have also been alive. So we could have drawn Gideon. Tefri also just tucks something. Tucks the thing. Tucks the token. I mean, he might still have lost, but whatever. I think we would have actually... I think that would have actually been the, the, the play. Oh, well, that definitely was correct, yeah. So 20, 29, uh, 38, 47. And then we add, we could block... Yeah, no way. Even if we survive the attack, the problem is that it just... It nukes we have board. nothing, right? Yeah. Right. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe button. Check me out on Twitch on patreon.com uh, slash franklapore on Cool Stuff Inc. I had a new article go up today about Pioneer and Boros Reckoner. You can also check out... Uh, What's it? Manatraders.com. Link and promo code are in the description below, and you can use, get 20% off the first three months with that. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Really appreciate you.